Nigerian radio broadcaster Ifedayo Olaride, also known as Daddy Freeze, who commended the Ogun State Governor for his kind gestures to BB Niger 2020 winner Lekon. Off the back of Governor Abiodun of Ogun State, who gifted a three bedroom apartment and a sum of 5 million naira to the winner of the 2020 Big Brother Niger reality. TV show later. And we also know that um, Wale Adenuga is not pleased with this um, kind gesture of Governor Dakbo Abiodun saying that there are a lot of Ogun State indigents that have done way more and deserve to be rewarded than the Lekon. And the Daddy Fish is coming back now with a job saying that, look, man, this guy represented Nigerians well. He had the two Amazing. one in school. So he who did, did not this, represent Nigeria when he, he did that? He did that. So he deserves this and more, blah, blah, blah. Blah blah blah. So, what you guys think? Personally speaking, I don't see anything wrong with. Mm -hmm. Let me start with this one. Nigeria cannot. Nigerians, as long as you are you are in this country, you cannot open your mouth, especially with these politicians, and talk about people who are undeserving of positions. Mm. I think that is mm. <laughs> extremely mm. hypocritical. True. We've seen it constantly, constantly. Same president. Constantly, Governors. for more important, influential positions mm. given to people who don't deserve it, sure. who don't qualify. Bam. We've seen that. We've even now seen you go as far as remove people who are <laughs> because they do not have NYSC or the person did not come back home to do what. We've seen that. So, in a way, all of them that are against are, are very hypocritical. Now, giving Lacon the role of an ambassador, to me, there's nothing absolutely wrong with that. You cannot take away from the fact that Lekon has a lot of influence, mm. quite a lot of influence. And he's influence. quite intelligent as well. Yes, he is. And even the representation in the character or the brand that he built on the show, to me, does not um, go against being an ambassador. ambassador. I think he's somebody that, he, he wasn't there to promote anything else. He was quite intellectual. He knew quite a lot about Nigeria. Even the, um, the test that they did with mm. uh, Fan Cross, uh, I don't, let me no do that. Yeah. Like that so. Anyway, they, they did the whole advert. The show was about that, about that brand, sorry. So, you know, they've done all of that. He's proven that he's not an empty barrel in that case. Mm. So if you're going to give this person an ambassadorial role to either um, use his platform to show more, um, show more focus on what needs to be addressed in the with the people of Ungu State, there's absolutely right. nothing wrong with that. The five million for me is unnecessary completely. Why? I don't think you need Who to give. Who's paying for his work? Personally speaking, personally speaking, I thought that the five million was a bit unnecessary because the Ungu State. What about the house? Which house? He got the house. Got five um, bedroom. Uh, thank you. Bungalow. Both of them as well. Like even that combination. I don't know. For me, I because my mother is from Ungu State and I've been there quite a lot. The poverty there is quite. <laughs> It's quite massive. I so, told in Ogun State, not that bad. Uh, mm, mm, mm -hmm. Let's not lie, fair. If fair, let's not lie. We, we, we live there. Can you crack it? Anyway, I, I just think that there's a lot of people in that particular state. If it was Lagos State, I'll say 5K and the house. It's not a big deal. I mean, 5 million and a house. But for Ongu State, I think it was a bit too insensitive to the people. Like, we've had, I know, I know for the longest time, people in Ogun State have especially the educational system, they have complained about um, really low pay for lecturers and students um, and teachers and all of that stuff. So there's been strikes for so many years. And that's just taking the educational system, for example. So you so, like the appointment, but you don't like what comes with the appointment. I don't, I don't like the fact the that they, they announced that type of wealth, even if you're mm. going to give it to him, which you can give and you can give like on your that's gifts or whatever. I just still. I just don't really think that... It, I don't know. It, it, it felt too insensitive for me because you already know that the basis in which you are giving um, Lekon on the position is a bit watered. Is a bit. Okay. It's not very. It's not grounded in, in mm -hmm. like you know roots and stuff. Like it's because he won a TV show that was already a bit flimsy. To then now go ahead and still stick to protocol of giving him a house and and five million. Like he's going to actually live there and and do that for a full time job. I don't you know. Never okay, know. So, uh, you never know. You never know. You are on both sides. Really. Yeah. Okay. I can see why for me. Um. I don't know. I feel. I feel like. Um, Lekon. Okay, let me take you back to the hypocritical part. You're talking <laughs> about. Yeah, I don't think that people are being hypocritical. I feel like even if we've been doing some things wrong, which we know that um, the way we probably choose our leaders and the system around that doesn't mm. work, it doesn't mean that when it is done wrongly, then we do not have the right to talk about it. Everybody that are talking about it, you cannot say they are the ones that have ensured that those wrong people, quote and unquote, were in that mm. position or that the right people mm. were taken out of the position. Right. So if you now categorically say oh because you are talking about it is hypocritical then it means that you are categorizing everybody in one box mm. and for Lecon 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 
I don't I know. I need him to Lekon. say his name because I don't know. He how said it's Lecon actually. Okay. Um, there was an interview I watched. Um, I I, do, I don't know the basis of this. I like that you followed his story, um, his history in the house, and you understand how intellectual he can be yeah. and how he can help um, Ogun states. But having to put this down on people, like you said, people that are already going through a lot and you have to put this on them, is a big deal. And also the problem with our government is the problem of communication. Wow. I think we get that absolutely wrong. Mm -hmm. There is a way that this announcement would have been made and it will sit well with almost everybody. I know you cannot please everybody, but there's a way you could have put it, breaking down the things that you would expect from him as a youth ambassador or whatever role you are giving him, and people will begin to understand why you are doing this. But right now, the communication that was sent out was... Um, materialistic at first. All you're seeing is, oh, he got a house, he got five million. A lot of ambassadorial position comes with these things. You don't just appoint somebody and expect them to right. give you their time and their expertise and uh, impact knowledge and expect them to do it for free. How do they feed? Right. You know, even when they don't call it salary or they don't call it um, remuneration, there is something they call it and you get this part time. You're either getting it monthly and don't be surprised that this five million naira, he's not going to get it once. He's probably mm. going to be on a salary. You know, that mm. will come monthly, but when you calculate everything for the year or two mm. years, I don't know how long it's going to be, then it all amounts mm. to five million. And a house, I mean, you have to be able to live somewhere. But when you the, come around. the question now is, is he going really to going to be there? available to do the job well, based we on never his know. own I trajectory? We I don't would, know. We would have to but, ask um, Lake on a that lot question. has to be done better, really. I, I, I don't know. It's, it's, it sounds really insensitive. It is but I insensitive. know that there is good intention behind it, but... Lekon will probably tell us the intentions behind it himself. And on that note, I will say for every shine, there is a time. For every time, there is a man. And Lekon, this is your time. So enjoy.